Camping Horror Story A little background story. I'm Tessa, in 14. I live in Minnesota, and I go to this one campground up north in the kind of middle of nowhere. I have gone to that campground for 11 years and still go there to this day. It's been open for only a year or two before I started going there, my mom is really popular there, we know everyone, they always are having a party or staying up till 1 o'clock drunk as fuck. This particular night haunts me forever, me and my friend Chloe were best friends. She was the shy brunette and I was the wild blonde, she always had this thing where she never liked sleepovers, this one night me and her planned on having a sleepover in a text outsider actual camper, our parents did not stay out late that one night for some reason. We had a fire and did regular camping things, it was about 1 when we decided to go in this shower house with showers and bathrooms, it was one of the best campgrounds in North America, it's a fact, not my opinion actually. So we were in the shower house planning to just hang out because the shower house and the lodge is the only place that has wifi. My data does not work because it is in the middle of nowhere, so we plan on staying there till 3 am, we are at about 2 am, and we need chargers. We go to her camper and grab our chargers, and on our way back we're outside the door for some air before we go inside, Chloe is on her phone, and around the corner behind her is an old guy or maybe a woman, looks to be 100 years old, and is walking a rat, looks like one at least. I scream and tell her what I see and the guy has a crazy smile on him, we run as fast as out long legs, let us about two steps till we get inside, I start crying because I'm so scared and she is freaking out because she does not know what was just behind her back. The plug in our chargers and hesitate to call either of our parents, we feel like they would get really mad at us and not even believe us, and we were out till 3 a.m. We were not even supposed to be up past one on that night, so now we are freaking the f out and ready to just bust out the door we have been in there for an hour at this point past the time we saw the creepy old man, and we hesitate to open the door, but end up opening the door I'm thinking that we are going to die and we ran out the door, and as I turn around I see the creepy old man with something that looks like a knife in his hand right around the corner of where we almost got stabbed, to this day we almost always remember this night p. That's our parents believed us and was mad at us for not calling them, dtw I'm a huge fan and hope I get featured. Thanks for watching, if you enjoyed the video hit that like button to support my work. And as always enjoy the fear my dear.